All right, so right now there's a lot of rumors that Debbie Parkins just recently passed away. I don't know if these are entirely true, but everyone's starting to talk about it. If you guys don't know who Debbie is, she's that one girl you might have seen on TikTok in downtown Toronto, Canada. You know, rapping or starting fights with people, you know, she does a lot. Anyways, let's check out a video, see what people are saying. Is Debbie Gang Toronto dead or alive? Some of these include Toronto Debbie, whose real name is Debbie Parkway, Chromazaka Janessa Molina Mendez, a Toronto-based rapper. And Marcella Zoya, dubbed chair girl who came to notoriety in Toronto for being videotaped throwing a chair onto the Gardiner Expressway in February 2019. Apparently Debbie Gang from YouTube would have died, as reported by a Twitter account friend of the young woman. At first, it needs to be mentioned that the circumstances surrounding any news due to Toronto Debbie's cause of death are not entirely clear. There were a few tweets claiming that she overdosed. However, this possibility has not been confirmed. Apparently, Debbie died of an overdose of fentanyl, bam. One said. All right, so a lot of people believe that Debbie actually OD'd on fentanyl. I mean, I still don't even know if these are true or false. Like, is it confirmed that she actually passed? If she did, I just want to say rest in peace. I want to say condolences to all of her friends and family. Obviously, it's not easy um, losing a loved one. It's, it's so sad when you hear about these stories of people ODing, man, because you just already know they're down this road in their life that is very dark and a road they never ever wanted to go down and you start hanging out with the wrong people, you start experimenting with things, then addiction comes into place and it's sad, bro. Anyways, tell me what you guys think and peace.